Hi everyone, Udi Mehrav here, founder and CEO of Caliber Biometrics. And today I want to talk about peak VO2 versus VO2 max and which one is what. VO2 is a measure of how much oxygen your body is using on a per minute basis. So it's measured in liters per minute. As you increase your exercise effort or any activity, the VO2 can increase. Uh, and that reflects the increased use of energy by your body. There's this concept of VO2 max, which is the highest amount of oxygen your body can use per minute under the most extreme conditions. And it is a feature of the human body that everybody has a maximum. All, each one of us may have a different value, but we all have a maximum VO2 beyond which our body is not able to take in more oxygen. And that is achieved at a very high effort level. Athletes often want to know what their VO2 max is because that is an indication of their general physical conditioning. Now, Caliber measures a quantity called peak VO2. That is not the same. Peak VO2 is simply the highest value of VO2 that you achieved during a specific period of time, what we call a session in Caliber. So if you go for a run or do a workout, your VO2 will go up and down over the course of the exercise. And the highest level that you attained is your peak VO2 for that session. It is not the same as your VO2 max, which is your fundamental absolute limit, uh, at least unless you get into better conditioning, of how high your VO2 can. So the peak VO2 is less than your VO2 max. However, if you exercise very, very hard and use caliber while doing that, your peak VO2 will actually get close to your VO2 max. And this way you can use caliber to measure an approximation of your VO2 max, but technically what it is, is just the peak during that session.